Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to yet another YouTube video where today I'm taking you to Mississippi's. This place is a pool bar and a social hub in Avani Hotel near Eben Batuta Mall. So stay tuned while I share my experience with y'all. Let's get to it. Now, moving on, throughout the week, these guys have a bunch of different offers and packages and what they call theme days or theme nights. And their famous days are Tuesdays and Fridays. Now, if you guys coming down over here and you just wanna get access to the pool, most of the days, you're gonna pay just 100 dirhams, you're gonna access the pool, and you're gonna avail that 100 dirhams towards the food menu that they have over here. So I've placed the order for a bunch of food items, and the way I'm gonna rate this place today is based on their food quality and portion size, the pricing, the ambience, and the service. So stick around while I wait for my food and show you guys what I got. I don't know what I was thinking sitting outside. I was just sitting outside for you guys, just to show you the view. Inside looks pretty nice, as you guys are gonna see from the clips, but the outside just looks much better, and it's just dumb of me to wear something black and jeans. But, oh well, you know, it is what it is. And uh, I have a fan, um, sort of manual fan, I don't know what they call it, um, Mississippi branded, you know. So we're just gonna sit here, fan ourselves with hot, some hot wind, while the food comes to us. Okay, so the food has finally arrived. So I've got one starter, one salad. I've got something from the sliders, um, some from the sandwiches, and from the sushi part of the menu. Of course, sushi always has to be there. No questions asked. But this time I've got a bit of a different type of sushi, so I'm excited to taste that one out and see how it goes. So I'm gonna tell you what I've got right now. So from the starter section of the menu, I got something called flamingo shrimps, which is battered and deep fried king prawns tossed on a homemade chili mayo. So sounds a bit like uh, your typical um, dynamite shrimp. Then moving on, I got something from the salad section, which is called a berry kale salad. So this thing is like a contraption filled with all kinds of berries in here. So it's got blackberry, strawberry, cranberry, and it also has mango, which I'm a huge fan of. Also has peach, has toasted almonds, candied walnuts. If I was smart enough, or um, you know, if I planned it better, I would probably not wear this and I'd say like it's hot but it's a perfect weather for a pool day but oh well anyway moving on to the type of slider that I got so it's over here it looks really nice it looks so cool I can't wait to dig in so what I've got is a barbecue beef brisket slider they say this is one of their most famous one and it's something that's like shareable so it's perfect for such an environment so it's in boa buns it's something that I've never seen before or I've seen on social media, like I haven't tasted it before. So it's my first time to try this out. Then I've got something huge. It's a nine, nine inch? Yeah, it's a nine inch chili cheese hot dog. It's massive. Um, so moving on, I got sushi, of course, which is called unagi and salmon tempura maki wow I don't even know what I just said it's the name is huge so it's crispy fried salmon topped with teriyaki marinated cooked eel hmm. two videos in a row I'm trying eel out and drizzled with crispy tempura flakes sweet soy sauce and spicy mayo that sounds so good I'm probably gonna start with that and then go backwards so I'm gonna try out the food and then I'm gonna tell you what I recommend and then we're gonna go to the rating of the restaurant. And of course, I always have to forget something in these videos. Uh, we have two drinks over here as well. 
which is one of them is called the Trappi Colada. So it's pineapple, coconut, and banana. And something called Mango Mule, which is mango, fresh ginger, lemon, and mint. So now let's get digging. All right, so after having a little bit from the items that I ordered from the menu, I'm gonna tell you which one I like the most. So starting from the starter versus the salad, the starter was the flamingo shrimp and the salad was the berry kale salad. And I gotta tell you, the berry kale salad, hands down, is my favorite one out of the two. The combination of the candied walnut and the uh, balsamic in there and the bunch of berries that they have in there just tastes so fresh and so refreshing. I really love that one. And then moving on, I got the chili cheese hot dog and the bar barbecue beef brisket sliders. Out of the two, I would have to go with the sliders because it's in the bao bun. That's number one, that's something unique. Uh, you know, when I hear sliders, I would assume they're just in burger buns, just in a smaller version, but this one took me by surprise, so I really like this one. But for the chili cheese hot dog, I would like the cheese to be a little bit molten a little bit more warmer on top, and I'd like the chili to be a little bit warmer as well. Then maybe I would, you know, choose that as well. And then moving on, sushi as always has to be on my table. This one is something different. Again, it has eel in it, it has tempura, it has salmon. It's, it's amazing. So that's also something that you guys should get while you come down here. Now I'm gonna wait and go for my dessert. All right, and last but not least, my desserts have arrived. So I got two desserts. One is an apple crumble dessert, and another one is a chocolate fondant with ice cream on the side. So I'm excited to dig into these and let you guys know what I think. The kind of stuff I gotta do filming for Insta and I'm filming for you guys on what I'm doing. Man, these two desserts, I really can't choose between the two because if you're a chocolate lover, then you gotta go with the chocolate fondant. But if you're looking for a dessert and you're not really into chocolate, then the apple crumble is your thing. I'd, I'd recommend both of them. It's very shareable, very tasty. The apple crumble dessert is done very well. The spice and the cinnamon in there is done to the T. And of course, that molten chocolate cake that's oozing out looks brilliant. But now, I have to come to the verdict and rate the different aspects of this restaurant like I mentioned earlier. So to begin with, the food quality and the portion size, I'd probably give it a 9 out of 10. Mainly due to the fact that the taste of the items could have been a little bit more amped up, like the flamingo shrimp and the chili cheese hot dog. But portion size was very good. You can share each dish amongst two, two people. And then next up, we're going down to the pricing of things. So the general menu pricings are quite fair, fairly priced. Not too high and not too low. You can find stuff which is around 35 dirhams. You can st find stuff that are like 100 dirhams. So it's really up to you on what you're looking for. Next up, I have to talk about the service. The service, I'd probably give it a 7 out of 10. Mainly due to the fact that, yes, this place is a pool bar and social hub. And most of the people are coming down here to go to the pool. But, you know, you generally when you're going to restaurants, they have dedicated waiters that are, you know, dedicated into a certain area of the restaurant or, you know, the areas. I keep saying areas. But, yeah, you, you get what I mean. 
you know, we're gonna have to keep searching around for someone to come and help us. So on that point, seven out of 10. Next up, I'd like to talk about the ambience. Ambience, I'd give it a 10 out of 10. The music over here is so nice. It's a lounge kind of music, some lo-fi genre as well, which is uh, something that I really enjoy. And it's a very chilled vibe. And there's a bar down there. You can order your drinks, you can order your food. So generally 10 out of 10. Now with that being said, I'm gonna dig into the desserts a little bit more and I'm gonna get going. But I wanna ask you all to drop a like, comment and subscribe to my YouTube channel as it's gonna help this channel out a lot. So it's gonna keep me going with showing you more content just like this one. So with that being said, see you guys later.